Hello, welcome back to Booking Gaming. Hi! I'm Travis. I'm Eric. And I have forced us into yet another God. video or video, probably, maybe one, I don't know, it could be two, it depends on how long it takes, of us just going to random places on the internet and yeah. doing things. There's no boobies. Who cares? I, I'm sorry. Uh, maybe we'll we'll find some somewhere. We I won't. I'll get us to play like Double D Dodgeball or something. Okay. That is an actual game, but it has no boobies in it. Well, it's that's... just called Double D Dodgeball. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but, but anyways, we'll, we'll I'll eventually we'll get. But we're gonna find out what kind of introverts we are. <laughs> yeah, because we probably are both introverts. But this is the uh, Myers Briggs test. Yeah, the Brooklyn Decker test. The, the Brecken Myers test, test is what I said. Uh, what I, what video the, was that? The Brooklyn Dodgers test. I don't remember. It was like one of the internet things we did. I was like, oh, we could. Oh, we were doing the Wiki was, game. Was it Wiki? And I said the Bre- yeah. it was like midnight on New Year's. Yeah, and I was like the Brecken Myers test, and he's an actor from the movie Road Trip. Okay, so we're on the, the, the personality the, explorer test. Yeah, we're on the personality lab. This is not the official Myers Briggs test because I was looking into doing that, but it costs like fifty or sixty dollars to get your results. <laughs> yeah, so I was like, just find one that's free. <laughs> we don't care about that. It's gonna have the same questions, so it's fine. Well, it's preparing my test. Yeah, uh, yeah. So Beam is going first. Yeah, he's going to take the me, test, Eric, and then either depending on how long it takes, I'll either also do it this episode or we'll do a second episode where I do mine. Right. So let's let's so get here to we it. Go. Uh, I can make new friends easily. Ooh. Well, I only have one. Do you? You have like work acquaintances, but you've had work acquaintances I, in the past. I, but do those count as? I friends? was going to say work. If you count work, then I would say this one. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't say oh, you're ugh. terrible at it. You just you're not actively like you're not going out and be like I'm going to find some new friends today. That's yeah, that's true. And if you but were, if, we were, if I was part of a group, like if we went out, I could easily make a friend. Right. Yeah. So, it's not I mean, like people I would know, hate you. But I would say that then. Yeah. Uh, I get that word, yeah. To work in a group. Uh yeah, actually. That's fine. Yeah. Me and you work well together. I don't usually I don't usually feel awkward in social situations. Mm, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the, with the old double negative yeah. trying to trick me. I like being the center of attention. <laughs> I was gonna say it's like that is center, but that's the wrong center, right? I think I want to say it's the English spelling. Is it okay? Or, you know, you know, British spelling. I was gonna say because I've seen that used as center, but that's not center how you of spell attention. Center of attention. No. I prefer phone. No, nobody. Who does? Nobody does. Extroverts. People's moms. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh wow, there's a lot to this. Okay. I think there's a hundred questions. I rather have a large group of friends. Nope. Small. I have. I have a rather oh, large group of well, friends. Well, same thing. Okay. <laughs> Being alone gets really tiring. Even if it's for a short time, eh. I mean, it depend. What do you? How would you interpret tiring? Yeah, I don't know. Like because you, like I, is that like you get tired of being alone? Because I'm definitely tired of being alone. But, but that, also relaxing on the couch for hours upon end is also great. Yeah, I mean, you could stick to. The I would middle. probably say middle. Yeah, because middle's like neither. Middle's kind of the cop. If you, I feel like if you put middle on everything, you would you wouldn't get a result. <laughs> yeah. I can comfortably approach people I don't know. Nope. Ooh. Uh, fast-paced lifestyle. No. No. I... What about that Ferrari you got parked outside? <laughs> right. All that YouTube money that somehow you have and I don't. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I swear I'm splitting the checks equally. <laughs> Fucking the Markiplier over here. Markiplier yeah. levels Mr. of Beast. money. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Beast money. You're just giving people money to stand in a circle? Yeah. I don't like I don't like keeping things to myself. Uh, I mean, even if you do it, you could not like doing it. Right. I like I I don't like keeping things to myself. You, I would you say pretty this much one. tell me. I mean, as far as I know, you tell me pretty much anything. Yeah. I mean, I, I'm sure there's plenty I don't know, but it's not like you're you're hiding things no, from me. I, would I say mean, I guess if one. you were, I wouldn't know. <laughs> right. <laughs> I know many people well. Wrong. I focus my energy towards the outer world more than my head. No. no. I gain motivation from interacting with people. If I answer these, it's because I'm like trying to help <laughs> yeah, you right. answer. I'm not answering for myself. I I'll do that online. I gain motivation from my interact. I mean, yeah, yes. That's the only time I'm extroverted is if someone else starts it. 
someone else starts the interaction. That is a thing. Like, you're, so, yes. you're very, because I'm, I'm kind of the same way. I would actually say probably strongly, depending on how you interpret that. Yeah, because, like, you're fine with being alone, and you're not, you don't actively go out of your way to interact with people. Yeah. But when you do have a positive interaction with someone, it gives you energy. Yes. Like, you're like, I would, oh, that was awesome. Right, and I would never start the interaction, but if they do, I can easily... Yeah, so and I would yeah, guess you, you I would do say gain this. motivation. Yeah, you're not motivation. You're not yes. motivated to interact with people. You're <laughs> yeah. gaining motivation from interacting right. with people. I enjoy gatherings and family reunions. No, I mean gatherings right. would be like friends, I guess. Yeah, going out for drinks or going to a movie so with a group or middle. Yeah, I mean they're fine. Game nights, they're okay. Depends on what the situation Does is. Does two people count as gatherings? I mean, all the, <laughs> right. our, our fans are here. This, then yes. <laughs> our Discord is a gathering. I like to go to parties and events. They're okay. Uh, events? Yes. I don't know. What do you mean? I mean, I, I, like describe. a convention? <laughs> oh, I feel like that's... Parties and events seems more like, like something where you're event. going to interact with a lot of people. Then... Like in a like a if you're going to a convention, you're not you're not there to be like, oh, I want to be around a right. bunch of people. I'm also not opposed to. I would say this one. Okay. Yeah. I often think out loud for the channel. Yeah. Yes. No, I mean, you talk to yourself. I talk too much. Never. I mean, no. <laughs> I mean, unless you get me talking about anime or... I mean, I'm going to have to do strongly agree on that one just because I always talk too much. in this ch On this channel, <laughs> Like, <laughs> I feel like I steamroll way too much, but I can't help myself. My mouth runs faster than my brain. Yeah, if I actually start get getting talking, then yes. Yeah, you get all like hyper and... Yeah. <laughs> just, and then you stop and you're like, oh, why did I do that? Right. I talk too much. It takes a lot to overwhelm me. Nope. <laughs> I don't like silence. I love silence. Really? Even like, like if you're sitting in, like, let's say you're sitting here, but if I was not here, you would, you'd be okay with having no sound? Well, nothing I, on. I thought that meant like people. I, I would assume it's just like, well then no, I love having sound. Cause you gotta have like background. Noise I always have a fan and a TV on. Right. So then. I mean, I don't know. I could be wrong. I, it's supposed to be how you take it. So don't take my shit into consideration right. i'm just kind of like well throwing yeah, ideas no, out I, there i guess that would probably mean more environmental yeah so then yes i no, i don't i mean uh my friends always know what i'm up to uh, yeah i don't know you're kind of scheming <laughs> yes <laughs> pretty much everything that happens in my life i post that's why not yeah i mean you posted. that's what i was saying like you don't there's not a whole lot that i'm like oh i didn't know that about you or... i always know what my friends are up to i don't know mm -hmm. Not really, kind I'm, of. I'm, well, I, I mean, what you tell the you tell stuff on the channel. I, I, yeah, I'm I'm open about things, but I don't like actively share things normally. Like this is what I'm doing and eating for lunch. Yeah, me and you don't ever <laughs> talk about like day to day stuff, really. No. So you don't know like what I do at work. You don't know, That's, yeah, what's going on I in my always, personal life, really. I would say this then, because I mean, you come over here twice a, a month, right? But, yeah. And I mean, yeah, we keep in touch. We're always like chatting on like Messenger and stuff like that. But we're never just like, oh, yeah, today at work I did this, this, and then. Right. Unless it's some like thing that's not normal. Right. I don't I'll, know. It's... I'll post about it on Discord. Yeah, it's, that's... it's guy conversation. It's we're not well, like, that's true. oh, well, today I did this and then I went here. And right. It, you know, it's... but you would also know like immediately if like a girl flirted with me. Oh, God. Yeah. Well, be... of course. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be like, because that's <laughs> the kind of shit we want to talk about. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm good at telling stories. Honestly, I don't. I don't feel I am. I feel, I feel like I like... try to start and just get all bit of blah, 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 tongue twisted and. I don't know. I feel it's it seems that one seems circumstantial from an outside perspective. It's like you can tell a story if you have like if you have it in the chamber ready to go. Yeah, you can tell a good story, but if like I put you on the spot and I'm like, "Hey, tell me yeah, about this," no. you'd be like, ah, "I don't, I can't remember." I can't be right. I'm, like, I'm could... one of those people that's like, you're in an interview and they ask you to tell about yourself, Examples. and you forget who you are. Yeah, or they're like, <laughs> "Give an example of a time you worked in a yeah. group and it worked great," and you're like, "Uh, I don't know." Right? No, I, I make idea. something up. What'd you eat yesterday? Uh, uh, yeah. So. Yeah. 
Yeah, because because uh, like the story of that teacher giving you an F on that yeah. report, like you told that story, like that you have that story, you know it, right? So I yeah okay, middle mid T B H. Yeah, you're mid. <laughs> I enjoy entertaining. People. That's all it says at the end. It doesn't even give. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> what have we done? We've walked into a trap. Uh, well, okay, that's weird because in real, like in real life, no, no. <laughs> I mean. Well, he, okay. But let as me, far, like, I love doing this channel, yeah. so, yes? Yeah. Well, let me ask you this. Is it, well, you, you don't enjoy entertaining people, the act of entertaining people? You don't want to, you don't try to entertain people. So, like, let's say you were telling a story at work and everyone well, at work was, like, into it. Loved it. Wouldn't you like that? I would love that, yes. Is that, yeah. So, so I mean... It, like I said, it's up to you, but I'm just trying to I'll like go with that one. give a broader what explanation. Is, what, what is this one? Just agree, then yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I enjoy being part of a bigger community. I mean, it would be nice if we were part of a bigger community. <laughs> yeah, right. I mean, are we technically part of this community? We're like the rulers of this community. I've got oh, my no. hand I've got my hands on my hips, by the way. Just for a visual on that. I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> we're like the king and queen, and you guys get to choose who's who. Spoiler, uh, we're, I, we're both queens. Uh, yeah, <laughs> we both slay. Yeah. Um, I don't really know on this one. I feel like this is another mid. It's fine. I prefer smaller groups, though. Yeah. So I guess I guess in the context that this is asking, we'll like this. Yeah, because it's not... It's. I don't think Myers, the two women that made this, were like, should we take YouTubers into consideration? Right. <laughs> <laughs> I, well, I, I always, should. I gotta say, side note. I always so feel so weird calling myself a YouTuber because that makes it seem it's, like we were like we're these well, professionals. That's better than I will never use the term influencer. Oh God, no, we don't influence anyone. No, we're YouTubers. If I've ever influenced anyone, it's influencing someone to fucking throw up in their mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I can recall events in high detail. No, mm. not really. Honestly, yeah, no. I memorize things easily. Yeah, kind of. More I mean, math, math nerd. Yeah, more interested in what's actual than what's possible. <laughs> um, uh, I would. I mean, honestly, that's a weird one. I'd probably put you in white on that yeah, one. Yeah, mid. Sorry, I'm like answering for you. I just. <laughs> well, that's what I was thinking too. I, so it's fine. Like you're, you've, yeah, I don't know. Like, how do I, how do I, how do I talk about this PC, like a, a, in a PC way? I don't know. You're, you're, you err more on the side of spirituality than I do. Okay. So I feel like. Yeah, that's a weird question. The possibility, you know, like it's. Cause it's faith, not belief in that situation. So that's hard to, yeah, that's hard to. Yeah. So whatever. I'll just sure neutral. Okay. I don't usually rely on my imagination. Well, that's what porn's for. You don't I, need your imagination. <laughs> 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 that's what they're talking about, right? Right. That's what I'm always talking about. I mean, I always, right? Always rely on my imagination because I just escape into fake realities all the time. Well, there you go. <laughs> I prefer learning step by step as opposed to what? If I'm building something for Minecraft or building Legos, then sure. <laughs> right. Well, I mean, what does that mean? Like, let's say someone's teaching you, like, you, you get a new job, you don't know how to do something. Someone's teaching you how to do it. Do they? Do, would you rather they show you the entirety of it Oh. and be like, here's how to do it? No. Or would you want them to go, do this, then do this, yeah. then do this? Okay. I, I mean, <clears throat> yeah, because I learn better by repetition. Okay. So. Yeah. Yeah, and I usually do write down or have a list. Or make like step cliff by notes. Step. So yeah, 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 step by step. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. A lot. Well, uh, we're only like forty questions in, and we're, we're fifteen minutes. So yeah, we overanalyzed a little bit. I think philosophy is a waste of time in most cases. That's all you. Uh, I mean, no. I'm, Okay. I find talking in metaphors annoying. No. 
That can be funny. I don't even. Yeah, what is? I mean, give an. I don't know. Right. I always give get, us a metaphor. I always get metaphors and <laughs> similes is something that's like something. What is a metaphor? Um, give me a metaphor. I don't know. I'm gonna look that up. Okay. Because I always like. I always blank on that. I like physical sports. They're fine. I don't do them, <laughs> <laughs> but I like them. Couch surfing. So. Life is a highway, I her mean, eyes were diamonds, he's a shining star, the snow is a white blanket. Well, then, they're not annoying. That's... Yeah, they're fine. The famous metaphors. The Big Bang. Chaos is a friend of mine. Okay. Well, then, no. We like, we're like puns and metaphors. Love is a fine wine. Yeah, it's just yeah. Okay. catchphrases. I'm a down-to-earth person. Yeah? Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't, <laughs> I wouldn't say you're like, you don't have your head in the clouds or anything. No. Yeah. I like, I uh, neutral, because I like them, I don't do them, but, I mean, I bowl. Yeah, I mean, that's more than I do. Uh, but, yeah, okay. Uh, learning to use tools comes to me naturally. What kind of tools? It's Well, it's learning to use tools, so it's something you, it, like, if someone handed you something... Like, let's say you didn't know how to jump a car. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm good at reading the room. Yes. I hate that book. I have a, I have good balance and coordination. Kind of, sure, I guess. Yeah. I learn from past experiences. Yeah. Yeah. I pay attention to detail. Yeah. Depends on what. If it's something I don't care about, then... The intricacies of an anime girl's dress. Then, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How f- the, the yeah depends the, on the, the frill example. To frill ratio. Yeah. <laughs> Hashtag. <laughs> I notice things in my environment faster than others. I would say yes. There's a lot of things that I'm like say something and they'll be like, "Wow, you noticed that?" Yeah. And it's like, I mean, yeah. And I don't know. <laughs> I would, so I would say yes. Yeah, yes. I've always, I, I mean, I've gotten that before in the past too, and I've, I've just been like, yeah, when, when you do spend most of your time not being the one talking or in the spotlight, <laughs> yeah, you tend to take in more of your oh, right surroundings. Yes. I sometimes fail to see the bigger picture. Yeah, I mean, I feel like that's kind of everyone. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I uh, mean, to an extent, sometimes would, failed. It. Yeah, yeah, sometimes, I, sure. Abstract art is not real art. Well, I mean, that's... I have a good sense of direction. No. No? I don't. If it, I mean, no, I don't. I can't, I can't find anything without GPS. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> so, I mean, I would... Yeah, just no. I focus on present instead of future. I love presents. N- no. I'm, I'm a worrier. Yeah. So, I'll, I'd say this. Because I'm also worried about the present. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just all around worried yeah i try to stay objective uh y- yeah what does that mean exactly unbiased yeah okay y- usually yes I, well i don't know yeah a lot of these are situations they really are honestly so, it's that's what you kind of have to just go with your gut yeah so agree i'm not very idealistic that one that one's always weird to me I have a good sense of fashion. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let me see. What are you wearing right now? Scorpions t-shirt. Yeah. I have I have anime shirts, anime slash video game shirts, and I have band shirts, and then I have work shirts. That's so, not really... So I would probably know, really but I think I have... <laughs> you dress... You dress... I don't know. You dress like a millennial. That's... Yeah. You know, it's... You I know. like to have something on my shirt. You know so how, to, but yeah, but and in a casual setting, but you also know when it's appropriate well, to dress nice, right? I don't know. I mean, no, I don't care about fashion, so I would yeah. say probably mid because I, I'm not a slob, right? Yeah. So yeah, staying in shape is more important than exercising my brain. I would like to stay in shape, but I don't. That takes I'm, too much work. But is more i mean no i'll just go with that um i don't know what does this mean like oh I, yeah i, I type that in 
characterized but often people have such an idealistic picture of farming i never have trouble memorizing people's names i'm terrible with names someone whose plans or goals of helping others are lofty grand and possibly unrealistic Okay. So someone who so like, like you're you, the idea of you doing something is so grandiose that so like out it's there unobtainable and... like ah, let uh, me read that again. Someone whose plans or goals of helping others are lofty, grand, oh, and okay. possibly unrealistic. Okay. So like you want to help everyone. Yeah. But you can't. I mean that would be great. I will, yeah, I will it's almost, go mid it's for that like, one too. It's it's someone who's very naively good. Okay. I can easily tell how someone else is feeling. Usually, yes. Yeah, empathetic. Seeing someone cry makes me want to cry too. Yeah, you depends. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Depends on the person. Seeing someone laugh makes me want to laugh. Uh, depends. If Ye- there there's a lot of people that laugh at stupid shit. Oh, I know. Um, I mean, I've talked about in other videos of people walking through Walmart and Yeah. Mid. Like you hear them joking with each other, and you're like, in then in no context. Even if I was part of that group, I don't think I'd find that funny. Yeah, easy for me to talk about feelings. I feel yes, sad. <laughs> <laughs> I am sad. <laughs> yeah, I follow my heart rather <clears throat> than my head. Mm, no, not honestly. No, not you have a logical. I don't, I don't know. You have you have a big heart. And you, you're an emotional person, yes. but you're also a very logical person. Yeah, I do overanalyze a lot of things, like a lot of, like it asked earlier. Yeah. Or th- overthink things, rather. But if you change the word heart to penis. Then... <laughs> yeah, yeah, I would say this one. Yeah. I tend to be superstitious. Not at all. No? Nope. I am religious. You're not even a little stitious? No, no. <laughs> not even regular stitious. <laughs> the writing is not on the wall. <laughs> I express my emotions freely, you piece of shit. Yeah, oh my god. I can usually tell a person's intentions by seeing how they act, yes. Comfortable crying around people? I mean, no, but I do. <laughs> it depends on the people. Comfortable crying around people? No. Yeah. No. Well, yeah, I mean, it depends. If I had a significant other, yes. Right, yeah. So, I mean, I guess, yes. I gotta say, I fucking love crying. <laughs> yeah. I love it. Like, even as just not even like a, I don't like being sad. Right. But just like sometimes when it just fucking like boils to the surface. Yeah. And then once you it get it out, you're just like. Like spills oh, out. Oh, fuck. I would say yes then, because if it's like close people, then yes. If yeah. If it's like in public <laughs> right yeah then no you're not the kind of person to just sit in a subway no like crying into your sandwich right and not giving a no, shit about i would head to the people. bathroom first yeah of course and after a good jerk session right harmony is important in my life i mean yeah that would be great <laughs> <laughs> what's that like <laughs> yeah. i tend to avoid confrontation yes i'm a peacemaker I don't really interfere with other people. Yeah. So I don't know. Not much of a moderator type. So. Yeah, I don't. I feel like, I don't know. I feel like disagreeing with that means you're a shit starter. Well, that's true. I would. Maybe not. I could be wrong. Well, I will stick in the middle then because I, I would. Yeah. I want there to be peace. I just don't know how to actually get in. You tend to just stay out of it. Yeah. Yeah. I sometimes distort the truth to make others feel better. I mean, everyone does. Of course they do. I connect... Especially when you've got a kid. Right. I connect well with animals. Yeah, fine. You're not, I don't know. You're, you, yeah, I don't... that's fine. It's just, you're, you're not a pet, you're not a big pet person. Like, no. you've had them in the past, but you're, like, you're not. I want to have a cat here, but it's like an increase in rent. Oh, yeah, and it's a pain I'm in the away ass. from home for so long. Yeah. It would literally be here all day by itself. I would want to adopt an adult cat, probably. That's a, that's hard to do though because yeah. we did that and it's like I mean she wasn't adult adult but the them acclimating to your life is much harder that way right but a kitten is high maintenance like yeah. <laughs> you really have to keep up with a kitten right there are some things that can't be explained with logic um, yes how do I keep getting girls I dislike <laughs> politics yes talking about them. 
<laughs> yeah. Sometimes my emotions get out of control. Uh, I mean, depends. Sadness, yes. Rage and anger, no. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever seen you, like, actually oh, mad. Right, I've seen right. you frustrated. And I've seen you really frustrated. Yeah. But it's all, like, I would it's say, very muted. Y- yeah. I've never seen you, so like, I, fucking go off. I would probably say strongly disagree, then, unless you count sadness. I, I get sad easily. Or yeah, but is that out of control? Out I of feel... Con- no, I'm always controlled. I was going to say, like, yeah, yeah. You, you're, you can... There are like worse days than others, but it's not like you're like, oh, I can't, I can't go to work today, or I can't. That's true. Talk. To I still people. go to work. I just right. Well, I yeah, I don't know though, because I do get overwhelmed. Yeah, I mean, you, I'm, I'm bumping well, up. Yeah. Instead of solving my problems, I'd rather focus on what I have. I, I mean, okay, yeah. It would no. be nice to be able to solve your problems, would be, though, right? Yeah. Instead of solving my problems, I'd rather focus on what I have. I don't want to. I feel like I, I feel keep, like that's a myth. I feel like I'm like influencing you, like a devil on your shoulder or something. But at the same time, it's like I don't want to just sit here silently and let you <laughs> answer. <laughs> like, I want to say things. I have a good understanding. I want you to do the same for me because I'm going to need help of right and wrong. I, I feel sure <laughs> that's kind of subjective. Yeah, it's. I mean, that's that's like an ethics thing. Like, would you steal a loaf of bread to feed your family type of thing? Right. Like, technically, based on the law, it's wrong. But yeah, yeah. yeah. This is strongly agree. <laughs> I have so many interests. Yeah. That it's like, you know, like sports and anime. Yeah. <laughs> and, and yeah, I but feel like I've talked about this. You're before. not one of those per- people that get so hardcore into something that that's your yeah. only. That's your whole life, and I've, everything else just falls away. I've mentioned this before, like where I have. A lot of interests, but then I actually like go and look at other people who have the same interest, and I'm like, oh, and it's God, be- yeah, no. it's because that's their only interest, y- y- right? Yeah, you're more like jack of all trades, ace of none. Mm, yes. Regular positive reinforcements from others motivates me. Yes, I never get it. I'm destroying my socks again. Why do I? I, I try. I, to, I was so good yeah. about not doing this for a long time, <laughs> and now I'm doing it again. I try not to offend people. When I speak, I try to connect with people. I mean. Yeah, that's another one I feel like everyone, even introverts, you're trying to connect when I speak. So when you are actually speaking, yeah, you're tr- you try to connect with people. Well, I mean, there are people out there who, <laughs> or when they talk, they it, it is a completely selfish to put other people this is down. About, or, you, or, or not even that, just being like, because <laughs> I mean, there are those people who, and maybe it's a way for them to try to empathize with people. It, but it's everything is always well for me. It's that, no, that's well, not what yeah, they want. Okay. Like they're not, I, they don't care about other people. I they're only waiting their turn to talk type of situation. Right. We'll go with. I like. Well, I feel like that one is probably. I don't. I'm not like super. Like, well, tell me about your day. And again, unless it's a loved one. Yeah. I'm uncomfortable with uncertainty. Yes. <laughs> I like to stick to a schedule. Yeah, kind of. I like to organize things around me. Um, no. <laughs> looking around your room here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can like to organize things. It doesn't mean it's easy to do. Yeah, my house. This is, the is best. definitely English spelling because that's. Yeah. Nice. It depends because I like to, I do like organized things like my games and making Excel spreadsheets. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, well, I mean, we used to make like our own D and D games. Yeah. Like, where we would make all the rules, and, like, the fun of that was making the, like, organizing all the damages and weapons and monsters. And I do live in a messy environment. I'm in a tiny apartment, and I'm a single parent. Yeah. (laughs) But it's, I feel like it's not like, you don't have trash laying everywhere. No, not trash. It's just. But it's always a mess. There's toys, and there's there's game consoles. and And there's not enough room to put any of it. Right. God, I why usually do, I do this. I usually Sorry. don't struggle with deadlines. So you usually don't struggle with deadlines. I would say, yeah, yeah. You that was like, you were, you were very much the super genius in high school, middle school and high school. Okay, your one fault was you never did your homework. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like you and that was a thing you didn't need to like you were you were acing everything and you were fine right but you never showed your the teachers always hated it because you never showed your work and you just like wouldn't do your homework because you're just like i already know this this is boring to there, me there was one time my science teacher 
was I forgot to do my homework, and he was like, "You can either write a hundred sentences <laughs> or take a zero. And I was like, "I'll just take the zero. Take the zero, yeah, God. <laughs> like I don't fucking care. My time is not worth that. And then, like, well, because I, that's the thing, you could probably think, still ace that class. I think he ended up being like, "No, that's stupid. You're doing the sentences. <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So there. I'm good at planning ahead. No, no, no. I work with constant amounts of energy. Nope. I'm a goal oriented person. Wait a second. Go back up to that. Yeah. I work with constant amounts of energy, not motivation. Yeah, I never, I, I don't work with energy. Okay, but do you have motivation, though? <laughs> no, neither. <laughs> no, I don't know. That's just weird. Like, how do you... Well, that's how do you, true. What's the difference? I work with constant motivation, then, is what this is, would be saying. I guess? That's, well, yeah, that's true. I hate questions like this. I guess There's that's There's a lot of it, interview, well, or not interview, uh... I guess that's accurate because you're not application questions like this. Yeah. Like, like I have stolen before, but will never do it again. How do you answer that? Like if you've never stolen before. Right. If you say no, is it like, oh, you're going to do you're it gonna again? You're going to keep stealing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Or if you fuck? say yes, then you're saying you've stolen before, yeah, you're but won't do it anymore. Yeah. That's a bullshit question. Uh, uh, yeah. I don't know. I feel like you've probably answered correctly on that because motivation, it's like, you're saying you you're low energy. It's not like you're hyper to do things. You're not like oh, I got to get all this energy out. Yeah. You're motivated by the need. Like you, it's something that needs to be done. Right. That's your motivation. So yeah, that that's. I still- I don't make goals. No. Me. Yeah. I regularly make to do lists. I mean, kind of not much. Actually, or like in your head, or yeah, sure. I prefer a methodical approach to things. Yeah. I guess. Yeah. I am sometimes criticized for being inflexible. (laughs) No, I don't know. Nobody's ever criticized you for anything. Right. I mean, no, I don't know. I'm well prepared for most possibilities. No. I have my life planned out. No. (laughs) I work well under pressure. Nope. I first work, then play. Nope, I, I play. <laughs> you at play work. at work, I yeah. Sure do. Talk about it all the time. I fucking hate working. <laughs> I value tradition. You're the poster child of the anti-work subreddit. Yeah. Right? But th- see, that's the thing. Like, I'm a. I work well, though. Yeah, you you have a good work ethic. I, I do my. You just work. hate every second. Of I just it. hate every second of it. And if there's free time, I'm playing my Game Boy or yeah, something. You're, yeah, you're gonna do something that you want to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I get um, it. I value tradition. Yeah, I like traditions. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yeah, I guess. To me, repetition is comforting. Yeah, self-disciplined. Yeah. Consider myself a good leader? No. No. Uh, I like to be well-informed before doing an activity. Yeah, I don't like spur of the moment. Just jumping into something and seeing what happens. Some people criticize me of being bossy. I do. <laughs> oh. No, I don't. Not even <laughs> I slightly. rarely procrastinate. I rarely second-guess my decisions. I can focus for long periods of time. <laughs> it depends. Yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah. If I'm sitting here and playing a game myself and not entertaining. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so. If you're actually like. <laughs> let's put that. But if I'm a... Oh, yeah. you're, get your results. Yeah, Uh-oh. get my results. Oh, God. Oh, it's going to be a sign up for this. It better not be. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, oh. oh Please don't be oh, a fucking thing. Because I looked it up, and this is the one that was like, oh, it's not. Don't sign up. Oh. God damn it, it is. Oh. Mother... Oh, wait, that is... You got it. It's up there. It is, but it's not. I don't know what... It, Hang on. I'm just going to look it up. All right. I'm going to read this. You're the you're the artist I'm type. also known as the adventurer or the artist. They are constantly changing open-minded people with a great sense of beauty and aesthetic. This is not correct. No? <laughs> you, know, you think? You think I have a great sense of beauty and aesthetic? <laughs> you're the ISFP. They are some of the most versatile people out there with an ever-changing mood and attitude. Here's the, I've got a better one. I don't feel like that's even this remotely is, this, accurate. I think this might be what you are. It's 
your ISFP. Okay. Which is what? I don't remember. I just remember the first. I don't... It doesn't say all of them. It just gives, like... Because each of them are, like, a quadrant of... Yeah, it's a four-quadrant thing. But ISFP, person with an introvert... Oh, there it is. Oh, wait, no. Introverted, observant, feeling, and prospecting personality traits. Okay, well then, all right. Yeah, that's what it is. In- introverted, observant, feeling. Okay. They tend to have open minds approaching life, new experiences, and people with grounded warmth. Their okay. ability to stay in the moment helps them uncover exciting potentials. Okay. Adventurers are true artists, although not necessarily in the conventional sense. For this personality type, type life itself is a canvas for self-expression. From what they wear to how they spend their free time, adventurers act in ways that vividly reflect who they are as a unique individuals. That's pretty accurate. Okay. I mean, you, you're you into mean, what you're into. Yeah, I'm and, into gaming, and that's yeah. what a lot of my posts and... Yeah, every adventurer is certainly <laughs> unique, driven by curiosity and eager to try new things. Well, people with this personality <laughs> often have a fascinating array of passions and interests. Yeah. With their exploratory spirits and their ability to find joy in everyday life, adventurers can be amongst <laughs> the most interesting people you'll ever meet. Okay, so I'm just a sad ad- adventurer. Yeah, there's different types, I guess, yeah. The only irony, unassuming and humble adventurers tend to see themselves as just doing their own thing, so they may not even realize how remarkable they really are. Oh, wow. I'm yeah. inspired now. Yeah. Oh, God, there's so much to this. Adventurers embrace a flexible, adaptable approach to life. Some personality types thrive on strict schedules and routines, but not adventurers. Adventurers take each day as it comes, doing what feels right to them in the moment, and they make sure to leave plenty of room in their lives for the unexpected, with the result that many of their most cherished memories are of spontaneous, spur-of-the-moment outings and adventures. that's true. (laughs) Whether by themselves or with their loved ones. This flexible mindset makes adventurers remarkably tolerant and open-minded. These personalities genuinely love living in a world filled with all kinds of people, even people who disagree with them or choose radically different lifestyles. It's no surprise that adventurers are unusually open to changing their minds and rethinking their opinions. If any personality type believes in giving something or someone a second chance, it's adventurers. That said, adventurers go with the flow mentality, can have its downsides. People with this personality type may struggle to set long-term plans, let alone stick with them. As a result, adventurers, t- adventurers tend to have a pretty cloudy view of their ability to achieve their goals, and they often worry about letting other people down. Adventurers may find that adding a little structure in their lives goes a long way towards helping them feel more capable and organized without quashing their independent spirits. Okay. I mean, I could keep going. There's a lot to this. I mean, I, well, no, here kind we go. Of, I'm about I guess to get to the end of it. It's close. Yeah. I'd say that I, I would probably... Maybe I'm an adventurer... With depression. Yeah, well, it's still, it's still, techn- it's still an introverted <laughs> yeah. thing. In their relationships, adventurers are warm, friendly, and caring, taking wholehearted enjoyment in the company of their nearest and dearest. But make no mistake, this is an introverted personality type, meaning that adventurers need dedicated alone time to recharge their energy after socializing with others. This alone time is what allows adventurers to reestablish a sense of their own identity. In other words, to reconnect with who they truly are. Creative and free-spirited adventurers march to the beat of their own drum, and it would be easy to assume that they don't particularly worry what other people think of them, but that isn't the case. Adventurers are thoughtful and perceptive, able to pick up on people's unspoken feelings and opinions, and it can upset them if they don't feel liked, approved of, or appreciated. When faced with criticism, it can be a challenge for people with this type to not get caught up in the heat of the moment. If they encounter harsher or seemingly unfair criticism, they may even lose their tempers in a spectacular fashion. I don't, that's definitely not you. (laughs) There's good news, though. Adventurers live in the present, and they know that they don't need to dwell on past hurts or frustrations. Rather than focusing on how things could be different, people with this personality type have an incredible capacity for appreciating what's right about life just as it is. Everywhere they look, adventurers can find sources of beauty and enjoyment that other people might miss. And this perspective is just one of the many gifts that they share with the world. Yeah, I don't know. It's got some that you may know. Lana Del Rey... June Cook, I don't know who that is. Mm-mm. Avril Lavigne, Kevin Costner, <laughs> Britney Spears, Michael Jackson, Jessica Alba, Beatrix okay. Kiddo from Kill Bill, Jesse Pinkman, Aowen from The Lord of the Rings. <laughs> what? Oh, okay. It's like even fake people. I, I okay. I, I like the Michael Jackson thing. Like you want to you want to be a kid forever type. <laughs> yeah, like yeah, yeah. yeah. So, I mean, I get it. I was a little worried when you said the Michael Jackson, when you agreed with the Michael yeah, Jackson. Thing. Adventurer then, might be a little 
It's but, it's a broad term. Yeah. I would say that's close. Maybe minus like I'm not that much of like a free spirit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Well, here's I I could do give you strengths and weaknesses real quick. I mean, we might as well I might as well just kind of like cliff note cuz this has got like all of them. Like you, there's no test on this that I've got, but it's we can do this test and then and just then use that look up adventurer or artist. I mean, it's the adventurer is like artist falls under adventurer, I guess. Oh, okay. I don't, yeah. Uh, let's see your strengths. Charming, uh, sensitive to others, imaginative, passionate, curious, artistic. Weaknesses, okay. <laughs> fiercely independent. Is that a weakness? Uh, unpredictable, <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> easily stressed, overly competitive, fluctuating self-esteem. Okay. Well, then I agree with all those. Maybe <clears throat> yeah. not overly competitive. Uh, romantic but... relationships, quite mysterious and difficult to get to know. Yeah. <laughs> While very emotional, they guard this sensitive core carefully, preferring to listen than to express. Okay. Adventure personality types focus instead on their partners with little interest in dictating the mood of the situation with their own feelings. While this can sometimes be frustrating, if they are accepted for who they are, adventurers prove to be warm, enthusiastic partners. Yeah. Okay. These, see, these sound more... Yeah, this is, yeah, this is pretty accurate. Correct. Friendships. Oh, God, here we oh, go. Oh, boy. Oh, no. These people fucking hate everybody. I'll be the judge of they this. They have close friends <laughs> that they actually fucking hate. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Uh. Or it'll be like, even, even the people that they think are their friends yeah. hate them. <laughs> oh, in friendship, adventurers are some of the most comfortable people around. Laid back and spontaneous. I, I see. I wouldn't call you spontaneous. No. I mean, it's just like anything. None, nothing's going to be a hundred percent accurate. People with this personality type won't bog things down when arguments are structured. With arguments are structured long-term plans. <laughs> Uh, intellectually exhausting pastimes like debates over European economic policy won't hold their attention. The here and now oh. is what's important, and they love spending time with their friends doing casual, fun activities. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Uh, yeah. Believe I... in actions, not words. Talk about what is, yes. not what could be. Yeah, I agree with that. <laughs> words mean nothing. If new acquaintances start things out by explaining, you do way better if it's unlikely they will ever be close. Adventurers just take these remarks too personally for comfort. People with this personality type are happy to get along with just about anyone, but potential friends need to ease up on being too judgmental or demanding. Okay. This is, yeah, this is... I mean, yeah, I agree with that. If somebody comes at you with a... Like, somebody could easily... I, I do... I, it's like the five-minute test. <laughs> like, yeah. Like, if somebody is an asshole, I'm going to immediately be like, I don't... Do you even want this? I'm, I'm not going to have this person in my circle. Yeah. <laughs> like, like you would be a lot, or you don't talk enough. I'm like, okay, I don't want to talk to you. Yeah, then no, just, you should smile. That more. doesn't, in, <laughs> yeah, that doesn't encourage me to talk to them. That makes me go, okay, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe this one was a paid thing. Like, right. This was the, of all the ones I found, this was the only one that I f saw the I reviews that were like, this is the one is that's yeah. legit. But all that must have all been ad. They just did really, they hid their shit better than all the All this kind ones. of crap is like that. It's you always get to like the that. end and then it's like, oh, we have your results. Pay $25. But at, least, at least they were dumb enough to give us the. A little, yeah. The never changing mood and attitude. Okay, so let's oh. see here. There's work stuff too. Oh boy. Adventurers loathe. Let's just say I'm a hard worker. Adventurers <laughs> loathe sitting idle in colorless, unchanging environments. Yep. That's, see, that's the thing. I'm not going to go on with a huge tangent, but well, it's. Why not? That's what we're here for. If it's unfulfilling. Yeah. I can't get into it. Like, I could pro Like, I can come home. That, I mean, I don't play a lot of video games because I come home and work more on our channel. Yeah. But I love working on the channel. That's the creative aspect of it. That's yeah. why artist is part of it. Because, yeah, you wouldn't consider it like, oh, I'm an artist, but you are. Because right. you're, you're creating It's not things. like, fuck, I have to come home from my 10 hours of work and do YouTube. It's like, right. I can come home from that 10 hours of work that I loathe and go, whew, something I enjoy. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> unnatural. Uh, feels unnatural in a management position. 
not a domineering yeah. personality type. I've always said that too. I never want to be a manager. I'm okay with being an assistant manager, yeah. but I always want to have someone above me. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> Fist bump. <laughs> they take no joy in exerting control over others. Unless. Planning long-term goals or disciplining unsatisfactory behavior. Yeah, okay. Conclusion. Few personality types are as colorful and charming as adventurers known for their kindness and artistic skills. Yay. I have to pee. I do too. Can easily <laughs> tripped up in areas focus on blah, 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 what they're just trying to keep. Yeah. Can be easily tripped up in areas where their focus on practical matters is more of a liability, whether it is finding or keeping a partner, reaching dazzling heights on the career ladder, or learning to plan ahead. Yeah. <laughs> adventurers need to put in a conscious effort to develop their weaker traits and additional skills. Okay. Yeah, that's, I mean... Yeah, a lot of that sounds that's pretty darn close. So you are, what was what was the lettering? Oh, yeah. It was ISFP. Okay. I have to So pee. there's the assertive... <laughs> oh, it's ISFPA or ISFPT. So assertive or tur- turbulent. What is that? Yeah, that's I, what I wanted to see really quick. What what the other ones are. I remember I introvert and extrovert, yeah. of course. ISFP. Yeah, ISFP. What is ISFP? It's a disease. Oh, God. The Introverted sensing, in- feeling, perceiving. Okay. How could you tell if a girl is this? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How do I tell if a girl is DTS? I mean, ISFP. So, yeah, there's there's dash A or dash T, and it's pretty much dash A is it's lion or house cat. Assertive. Oh, okay. Assertive is lion. Turbulent is house cat. Okay. Is that like a hyphen A or hyphen T? Yeah, it's yeah. so ISFPA okay. or ISFPT. Okay. Well, next time we'll do we you. We will do mine. If I get the same thing, I'm going to be annoyed. But we are very much alike. <laughs> we so are. we'll see. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that's what you that's what you clicked on. They're like with another really baby. I mean, that's just you as a girl. Oh. It see if it's a good type. Is it a good type? Is, is it Are there good, any bad types, really? Is it, is, is it bad? Peaceful, caring, and considerate nature. Kind, friendly, sensitive, easygoing. Yeah, I mean, that's... Mm, yeah. yeah. It's the artist. The artist or the... I guess it's just called two different things. The artist or the adventurer. Okay. Sure. So, we will do mine next time after a quick bathroom break. There you go. Because, holy crap, I really have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> so, <laughs> there are one out of 11 people... 12, one out of 12, 11 and a half people that are like me. Yeah. Look at you all fancy. That's the fourth, mo- fourth most common. Apparently. I wonder what the least common is. I don't know. We'll never know. Because <laughs> I'm not going to click <laughs> if on If I get that, I'm going to be, <laughs> yeah. it's going to be like famous people you could know that are this. Benito Mussolini. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, no. 